Alright guys, so here I am on WWE 2K24. So I'm going to be starting my My Rise playthroughs. And first off, I decided to do this not live, uh, so off-screen recording. Mostly because I figure with this game, um, since it's new, I'm probably going to be playing it live most of the time. So this will be something a little bit different uh, for my My Rise playthrough. So I kind of set a goal for myself to try to get the both these My Rise playthroughs done um, relatively quick while the game's still new. For a couple reasons. One, to avoid spoilers, which it's kind of funny because I never finished the My Rises from last year's game, which at some point I'll go back and do. I don't know when, though. Uh, and I somehow never got spoiled on those, so maybe it would be fine if I waited, but uh, I kind of wanted to play these, see what they're all about, uh, just in case I get spoiled and to, I guess, get the achievements. So I figured we'll do this off-screen, just to be a little bit different here. It's kind of like my other playthroughs, how I do it, so. I'm thinking what we'll do is, um, I don't know, I don't think I'm really going to go too in-depth creating someone, like, super crazy, like, um, probably just random most of my stuff, because I don't really have anyone in mind or anything in mind to play as, so... I guess let's just go ahead and dive into it. I guess uh, one more thing to mention is um, I think we'll, how we'll present this is I'll play in the max difficulty and um, if I lose um, and I'm required to win, we'll just cut back to the point of where I lost just so it's not too long, uh, but also keep that first loss in so we don't lose that commentary, you know, because it's going to be my first reaction to these storylines, right? So, kind of like how I do my other playthroughs to the other games. All right, welcome to My Rise. Between this year's two unique My Rise stories, Undisputed and Unleashed, there are 10 save slots available. Wow, that's a lot. <laughs> Both Undisputed and Unleashed have pivotal choices that can send you down distinct pathways with their own characters, arenas, and clothing parts to unlock. So I guess that's confirmation off the bat there's missable stuff. Try playing each story multiple times to experience different outcomes. Um, so, um, if everything goes right, we'll do... Uh, one playthrough of each with my first reactions and choices and then I'll have to go back and see what the alternate stuff is for like kind of like bonus stuff like I do with my other playthroughs But because this game's new I don't like you know know or have a guide of how to get all that stuff So we'll see how I do it um, Importing characters don't forget you can import created superstars in my rise to import a character move or an empty same slot Push RB to select a created superstar character to import please note this character's overall will not be imported Okay, so I don't have any creator wrestlers, so we're not going to be important. Anything. Okay, I don't know why I have a save slot if there's nothing there. Undisputed. I don't know. I don't know. Undisputed, I think, maybe is the men's. Because the only thing I know is it involves Roman Reigns. What if I delete this? Okay, I don't know why there's a default slot. Okay. Here we go. Select your journey. My Rise WWE 2K24 features two original WWE stories to play. So our first choice is Unleashed. You define your own rules and the wrestling company you built from the ground up is the hottest promotion on the indie scene. But when given the opportunity to share your talent on a larger stage of WWE, will you unleash your full potential or hesitate and hold back? Undisputed. Roman Reigns unexpectedly vacates his championship, ending his record-setting run and leaving the seat of, at the head of the table empty. Will you take it and become undisputed or fall short in your quest to stop, step out of Roman's shadow? Okay, so I think I'm going to start with the women's this year because I started with the men's last year. As if that even matters, I never finished either one. But I'm thinking we'll do the women's one first. Um, so I don't know which one's going to be better or if they're going to be both alright or good or really good. Guess we'll guess I'll find out. TBD brings the heat! The undeniable best of the West Coast wrestling scene returns with hard-hitting action in TBD Presents The Battle of Las Vegas! All bets are off as newcomer Psycho Sally continues to wreak havoc for TBD promoter Geneva Rose! Cole Quinn takes on fan favorite El Ordinario in a technical wrestling clinic! And in our main event... Will Ruthless Challenger Odyssey Rift defeat the longest running champion in TBD history, the locker room leader and captain of her domain and in anything goes, sure to be brutal, TBD rules match? Forget what you've seen, throw the rule book out the window and brace yourself for non-stop hard hitting action, this is TBD! All right, well, I guess we just established what the indie promotion is. Great, you're a superstar. So, I think I'm going to actually 
cut out the creation process because I don't think I really have much to say, nor am I like trying to make anything specific. And to be honest, part of me is thinking about just taking one of these default like templates. But I think I'll do a little bit of modifications, mostly moveset stuff. Um, Cause yeah, I don't really have much to say. I know I, I thought about potentially like downloading some from Team Creations or trading like a real wrestler, but to me that kind of ruins like the immersion. Like I'm supposed to be some like unknown indie star, and it'd be kind of weird to see like an actual wrestler acting like that. Um, so I'll cut here and I'll check back in with what I got. So I'll see you there. Oh, okay. It's just gonna throw me into this. Okay. <laughs> I didn't get to do my moveset or entrance or anything. Okay. Well, I'm assuming it'll let me change it after this, but uh, all I did was my uh, appearance and like uh, height and weight and name and all that. I guess maybe importing a superstar is the better choice, but uh, I guess regardless, here we are. So it didn't even let me choose like difficulty or anything. Uh, so at the main menu, I have legend selected, but I don't know if that's gonna carry over or what. I mean, this arena looks pretty cool. This is a pretty good start. I guess this is my opponent here. <laughs> Looks like an indie vet right here. <laughs> so I guess you'll be seeing my person. Uh, so for her, I... Like, I, I kind of did what I said I was going to do. I just kept hitting random on the attire, so I got kind of something I wanted to work with. And then I just changed the attire. I didn't do co go crazy with, like, logos and all that stuff. Uh, I just modified my attire. And then I made an alternate attire, but it's just alternate colors. Um... For the name, I know the name doesn't matter in these because, like, you usually have like, a nickname everyone just calls you because they're not going to record all those names. But her name's Vicky Vibrant. <laughs> and I think I have her at, like, 5'7". Uh, I selected Technician as the um, fighting style. And, yeah, I guess that's really about it. That's all it let me really do. I guess I'm the TBD champion right here. To be determined. Got some TBD... Uh, Shirts in the crowd. Hopefully all these guys stop by my merch table after this. Get some 8x10s. I'm selling them. Oh yeah, by the way, there was no Vicky call name. So when we get to a point where there's announcers, I guess. I just selected Victoria. That's my real name, I guess. Alright, big pop for the champ. Let's go. Are the scouts watching? I don't even know if my character wants to get signed by WWE. I guess we'll have to see how the story goes. Wait, we're, oh, I think I forgot to put the makeup on the ring gear. I'll have to fix that. That's not there for some reason. I thought I did, though. I guess why I did that. The TBD Championship. <laughs> yeah, here we go. Yeah, I really like this arena. It's pretty cool. DDT! Start off strong against Odyssey Rift. All right. Come here. Yep. I wish I knew what my moveset even was, but... Backer with the weapon? Alright, well... I wonder if I have springboards. Nope. Alright, there's a Slim Jim under here. Oh, we can't afford the Slim Jim sponsorship. What am I talking about? Oh, she's dead. What is this? <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm supposed to look strong. Did she read the objectives? <laughs> oh, she's pissed. I think one of my shots was too stiff. Stiff forearm, though. I got objectives to do. Come here. Kendo stick, courtesy of Steve Blackman. <laughs> oh. Okay, predictable Irish whip. For some reason, the computer loves Irish whips this year. Okay, maybe this is on Legend. I'm getting reversed a pretty decent amount. Got combos, though. DDT! Her head's already orange. She hasn't even lost her first layer of vitality, though. Like, I don't even know what my stats are or anything. I have that My Rise Mega Boost, but I don't know if that's the thing I have to apply after this or what. Oh, God. Set up a table. All right, got you. Doesn't say where to set it up. I'm just going to put it right here, I guess. Oh! Imagine if that would have put me through the table. Set the table on fire. Oh, I need a finisher for that. All right. No, 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 no. Not yet. I'm trying to pick up this Kendo stick again. Maybe a crowd taunt or the trading bullet mini game would be my friend right now. 
Uh, flimsy tables. I'm a little concerned because it's kind of annoying uh, in this game. Um, when you set a table on fire, it's still like flimsy, so it costs a finisher to do that. So if it gets knocked over, I don't know if it's going to be like a cutscene putting her through or what, but if it gets knocked over, I'm going to need another finisher. It's super frustrating, man. <laughs> I just had Brett's taunts. <laughs> I swear I did not do this. Teen off in the corner here. Okay, so yeah, my uh, paybacks are comeback and iron jaw. Looks like my comeback's in the corner. Oh! Oh, I could have sworn I guessed Irish Whip for the uh, breaker. The brawn breaker. Oh, no. Alright, come here, you big goof. No! <laughs> Rip signature move. Oh, my God! Missed. I think she's gonna try to pin me off that. That sucks. Yeah, that sucks losing all my uh, momentum. Okay, big zero count. Wonder if I should. Oh god, I got no stamina. I was gonna say, I wonder if I should do comeback. Or maybe the trading blows mini game. Okay, iron jaw. That was a big waste. There goes my meter. Okay, big zero. I'm in the day. I might fail the first match. This is definitely on legend, I think. Why are you holding me like a goofball here? Don't touch the table, please. <laughs> okay, get off me. I think I'm gonna go come back because I could really use the bar. I really hope this is a cutscene putting to the table or else. This could go pretty poorly. God. He's too strong, guys. Okay. Big dodge. What is she doing? <laughs> Oh god, I'm like dead right now. I can't. <laughs> Please. Yeah, okay, let's see what my comeback is. The Danielson comeback. My god. Vicky's fired up. Alright. Champ looking good. Gotta set this on fire. Uh, how am I gonna put her through though? There's a couple options, I guess. Throw her out of the ring. Hold on, there might be an easier way. Fish and pasta. I don't know if this is lined up. I'm just gonna try it. Ah, oh, it worked! <laughs> My god. Defeat Ozzy anywhere in the arena. Alright, come here. Bring us your move. Vicky's fired up! The big comeback! <laughs> Oh. Okay, this is I think this might actually be on legend, so I'm gonna try to stun her before doing my finisher. I'm not gonna risk it. Especially because I could lose at any point here. Okay, here we go. She stunned it three. Let's see what my finisher actually is. Vicky's got her down. Crossface is my finisher. Tap! I'm the champ for a reason! Crank it! Crank it in! Oh, what? <laughs> that looked so awkward. It like instantly loaded the cutscene without even showing the tap out. Let's go. Okay, I gotta fix my... I'm gonna have to fix my makeup. If, if it lets me edit my moves, I gotta do that too. I think I might have one submission and one regular move. Who is this now? <laughs> this is an NPC right here? Check out my merch stand. T B D. This, this is what it's all about. They said that we were too loud, too proud. They told us that we couldn't do things on our own terms, and we said we weren't asking for your permission. Damn. I don't know who she's talking about. I guess the critics, maybe? <laughs> People bashing me online or what? 
Yo, TBD champion, let's go. Alright, continue. I'd like to edit my stuff though, please. TBD rules championship match, what does that mean? <laughs> oh, here we go. The My Rise Hubs, this is kind of familiar. You discover new story opportunities from here by talking to people within this hub or by replying to posts and direct messages in your social media feed. So, here's the thing. Um, the disadvantage about me not playing this live is uh, I'm probably going to miss out on certain things. So I'll probably have to go back. It already said there's like alternate choices and stuff. So either way, I'm going to have to go back. But uh, it is what it is. It's just like kind of like a blind first playthrough. So. Icons next to each superstar in the hub will tell you whether a story is a must-play story, an optional story, or a challenge match. If you want to go through the main path story quickly, focus on the must-play stories, but it's recommended to try all types of stories as they present new pathways and rewards that you would not otherwise get. If you're ready to move on with the main story, enter an available story gate. However, once you enter a story gate, you'll not be able to go back and play any of the optional story uh, challenges. Oh, so, okay. Okay, so let's options first off. Oh yeah, so here's all the stuff I was talking about. Social media feed, attribute upgrades. Yeah. Um, so let me see if it actually was on Legend. It was. I think I'm gonna keep that, and then we'll keep that same philosophy. If we lose, we'll just cut back to the objective we failed at, so we don't lose too much time, but keep the first loss for the commentary, I suppose. But uh, let's see my attribute upgrade. So I should have that my rise boost thing here. 75 overall by default, which is pretty decent. If I can get to 85, I'll get resiliency, which should be huge. Great points, okay. Available points, 205. Oh my god. Okay, so what do I... What do I want? Wait, is this all the... Okay, I mean, it makes sense. I guess they dumb it down. because At this point in the series, there's a ton of attributes, but... Uh, let's see what I can do here. I mean, resilience. I'm the big indie babyface star here. I mean, I said I was going to do submission, so... Dude, this is going to put me at, like, a really high overall right off the gate. This is, this is so much! This is cheese, my man! I guess this promotion really does have the rocket strap on me. I have nine points. <laughs> I exactly used all the points. That puts me at 86 overall already. Wow. Alright, sure. I mean, it's on Legend. Everything's fair, right? I will spend those points. Okay. So, I'm going to cut once again because I want to fix the makeup of my appearance. I'm going to get an entrance, a move set, and I guess a victory motion. So, I will cut back and see there. Okay, I'm back, so I fixed the makeup. Um, I did select some entrance and victory motions. I just went with some preset ones. And uh, for the moveset, I really only changed the finishers, and that's really about it, because uh, I kind of want to see what this default technician moveset is. If I don't like it, then I will change it again, but for now, I kind of just want to play, so. Here we go, so Psycho Sally and Geneva Rose. What do you got to say? That match was awesome! <laughs> Be careful, Sally! You'll give her a bigger head than she already has. So, flaming table again? Time tested, crowd approved. Also an insurance risk. Not to mention we've seen it before. But that was one hell of a main event. Way to rally the crowd afterwards too. Well, I meant what I said. I told you when we founded this place that we could pull it off. Couldn't do any of it without you. Oh, I know. I'm very aware of how much time I spend doing paperwork to keep the lights on around here so that you can go out there and break stuff. But you break stuff so cool, Gap. I just hope I can put on a match like that someday and, and have that sort of confidence on the mic. A reason why you can't. You may be new around here, Psycho Sal, but you could be the future of TBD someday. <laughs> Heck, she could be the future of WWE tomorrow, literally. Really, Sally? You're going to the WWE Vegas tryouts? You're not mad, are you? I do feel bad even thinking about leaving after everything you've done for me. After everything you've done for this whole locker room, really. There's a reason why we call you the captain around here. 
Mm, so our first choice here. So I guess we've established a few things that Geneva Rose person is one of the co-founders along with me, and I'm like the the main event talent around here. Uh, I mean, I don't know anything about Cycle Sally, so I, I guess I'm excited for her. Who am I to stop you from pursuing an opportunity like that? I'm not mad. I'm excited for you. Huh. Even sounds like she means it. What's that mean? Let's just say that WWE is not exactly looking for people like me. They have a type. I'm good at doing my own thing. Different strokes, you know? I'll never make they it. They were literally looking for people exactly like you. Cap turned them down a few years back with some strong four-letter words. Whoa! I respectfully declined WWE so you and I could start TBD together and work with all talent, including those who don't fit their mold. Look, I have no ill will towards WWE. Going there just wasn't the right move. If that's the case, you'd have no problem coming with me to the tryout. Wait a second. This feels like a trap. Look, Sally needs a ride, and we need new talent for TBD. WWE can't sign everyone from the tryouts, so you go, watch Sally's back, and you lurk. And if you walk away with some new names for us to reach out to, so be it. I could sure use the support. Obviously, I can't go as the boss of a rival promotion, but a top, technically free agent? Fine, I'll go with you to the WWE tryout, but don't expect me to like it. I wouldn't ask you to. Hooray! Man, I'm gonna light the tables on fire. <laughs> I'm a psycho, man. Even though that girl's name is Sally Psycho. All right, here we go. Um, so by the way, I didn't see where I could put on the um, resiliency. I should be able to use it on um, 85, but it was grayed out in the thing. So I don't know. I guess let's keep playing and see what happens. So let's go to this tryout. We're heading to Las Vegas. <laughs> Ibiasi's laughing. Biggest match of the year. That show's already passed. This loading screen's outdated now. We just saw this show. I can't believe they just let me walk right in here. <laughs> it's a tryout, not the CIA. I can't believe I'm here at all. What's that they say in old movies? You got moxie, kid. And don't let my negative attitude about this place sway you. You could learn a lot from WWE. You got this. Are you really afraid of running the ropes? I thought you were a big shot college star. Yeah, I ran on a track. I didn't hurl my body into tight ropes. <laughs> tight ropes? Really? I don't get why they keep inviting so-called athletes to these things. WWE should focus on talent who actually know the business. Oh, here we go with this discourse. <laughs> Maybe you could focus on minding your own. Oh, business, get her, dude. That is. <laughs> wow. Great comeback. You didn't seem worth the effort to come up with a better one. Wait, don't I know you? You're with TDD. They call you the captain over there, right? That's actually not my name. But if the reputation fits... You must get it then. We're not here to have our spot taken away by someone who's never even stepped in the ring before. If you're worried about losing your so-called spot to a rookie, you're probably in the wrong place. Are you really that insecure? <laughs> oh, I'll show you how insecure I am. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Look at Regal! You couldn't stop yourself from making trouble for even a moment, Cap. Uninvited and still somehow a thorn in my side. Ladies, ladies, we don't have time for shenanigans today. And that includes whatever beef anyone in this room, Shotzi included, might have with someone else from the independent circuit. My colleague, Mr. Regal, is right. We've got a busy schedule today to get all of you seen. Even those of you we weren't expecting to see. Yes, the curious question of our unexpected guest. Thank you, Justine. I'm not disappointed to see you, but I am confused. You've turned down our invitations in the past, but you show up today what can I say? Circumstances change. I'm ready to give it a try. Yeah, she's super stoked to be here. Well, that's just fantastic. Everyone warm up. We'll get started soon. All right, get into a fight my first day here. This is good stuff. I mean, they just let me walk right in. No security or anything, man. So, why are you really here? TBD scouting trip? Well, I... Respect. 
Oh, right through it, man. <laughs> I got exposed already. All right, DMs. Do me a favor. Try to keep a somewhat low profile today. Thanks, Stealth, in your scout. Well, it's already... I mean, I got into a fight with someone like five seconds in. Oh, it's just, like she just said, might be too late for that. Didn't you just get there? Oops. <laughs> what did you do? Sorry, I got to go. Busy doing your dirty work for you. Just let me light a table on fire. If I got any DMs. Oh, my... What? I'm not reading all this, dude. Oh, this is my social feed. Never mind. Alright, so we got fake Twitter here. Optional icons will appear next to the various posts. See, this is what I'm concerned about missing stuff. I really think it's going to happen. Alright, so I know this uh, Justine. I only know from like messing around with the NPCs last year. It was like the character in one of the My Rides. But again, I didn't finish those. So Yeah, I'm not reading all this. <laughs> So we got Shotzi, Carly Prime. <laughs> what do you gotta say here? What are you even doing here? Thanks for the help out there. Tight ropes. I must have sounded like an idiot. <laughs> well, if I want to act like the people online, just freak out over small mistakes of people that are new. But no, everyone starts somewhere. No problem. And hey, everyone starts somewhere. I didn't know about any of this stuff until I started watching and doing it, and, well, learned all about this stuff. Uh, fair point. I just didn't want to pass up a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity because I thought I wasn't prepared enough. Especially since the recruiter said they could train me in the basics. You did track in college? All conference. Set my fair share of records, too. Ever been in a fight? Does online count? <laughs> Probably not when you're in the ring against someone who has. But you'll figure it out. Good luck today. Find the good guy here. All right, Chatsy. What's what's the, what's the history here? They didn't really explain. I really wasn't expecting to see you here today. I can still see they don't really sync the voices on these like uh, they're not really cutscenes. They're just kind of like these They're just animations with voiceovers laid over which is fair enough, but I mean they're kind of yeah, that is what it is What can I say it was a last-minute decision and Regal and Justine don't seem to mind. Why do you? Are you really going to pretend you don't remember how you refused to book me in TBD? <laughs> <laughs> well, never mind. I guess I'm the bad guy first off I don't do the booking. My business partner, Geneva Rose, handles all of that as promoter. And secondly, no, I don't remember that at all. TBD was the hottest emerging promotion, and there was never any room on the card for me because someone else was hogging all the attention as champion. Hogging attention as champion? You mean successfully and consistently defending my title? You say tomato. I say you're a selfish, overrated champion who I could have easily beaten if given the opportunity. I'm sure you told Geneva not to schedule the match. Maybe you weren't good enough. Maybe it was an honest mistake. I'm sticking with the good guy route here. I can't speak for Geneva, but sounds like an honest mistake. I'm sure we would have loved to have you on TBD, even if you wouldn't have beaten me for the title. Damn, shots fired. We can agree to disagree. What we can't disagree on, however, is that I'm the one in charge today. But since you're so talented, you won't mind the tryout match I just set up for you. What did you do? Flaming tables match. Just set up a match against those two other potential recruits. Since you had such an issue with them, felt right for you to take both of them on at the same time. A two-on-one -on -one handicap match? Yo, where's Sally at? She leave? <laughs> sure. Why not? Unless you want me to tell Regal and Justine it's a problem. Uh, you know what? My problem's with you. My only problem is with you. I have a feeling this is going to be called back when I, I'm assuming eventually get back to the WWE. Likewise. I look forward to evaluating your performance. All right, so second match is the handicap match, and I'm a psycho playing on Legend. I'm the real psycho Sally right now. Options menu. I mean, 
Oh, okay, there's a story. I remember this now. I gotta make sure. I feel like I'm still gonna miss something. I know I'm calling it. All right, let's go to our match here. Still this outdated thing. I mean, it's kind of cool how like Brooklyn Von Braun's on there, Josie Jane, Cole Quinn. Taking on two other potential recruits at once. Oh, Sally is in my corner. Make an impression, but dare I say, risky. I like risky. Try to win the handicap match. I respect match. it. But we'll find out soon enough if she can handle oh, my ribs. <laughs> don't hold your breath. She can't. I don't know what their overalls are, but I got that My Rise and Mega Boost, she right? Can really do. Oh! Regal, help. You're back in the series. Help me out here. Okay, big reversal here. I've already lost like three fourths of my first layer of vitality, so we got stuff to do here. At least it's uh, one on tag and not. Uh, not uh, one on two. Ah, the smell of a handicap match in the morning. And it's just random commentary from them. It's like the audio sounds so weird. I got combos here. Yep. Arm trap, scoop, slam. All right, slow it down. Pointed elbow. I guess I'm influenced by Brett. I mean, this technician moveset seems to have a lot of Brett stuff. So <laughs> I did change my finish. I did keep a sharpshooter though, just <laughs> for classic sake here. This was supposed to be easy for you, Cap. Do right, you not see what's happening? Her head's already orange. She lost the first layer, all right? Come here. So, this game, they upgraded the amount of finisher and signature slots are. So, like, I have, like, a bunch of different finishers. <laughs> so, we'll see what I do here. Are you sure we need to sign anyone new in WWE? Actually, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna go for a submission to see if, uh... Oh, she came in. Okay, so, yeah. Oh, my God! <laughs> Right, can you can you just get out? Um, so I talked about this if you haven't seen like any of my 2k gameplay yet There's a new thing here if you see by uh, Starla's hug, there's like an X So now she's debuffed from coming back in the ring So tag matches don't nearly go on as long as they did before so if you're smart about it You can kind of trick the AI and she reversed it <laughs> Excellent stamina you can trick the AI into coming in and they don't have to worry about your stuff getting interrupted but uh, my signature got reversed, so that's kind of rough. Bad time to taunt. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God, that was close. Talent just keeps getting better and better, huh? Big reversal. All right. I got no trading blows mini game if it's only in one on one matches, so. Oh, kind of, kind of combos here do I got. Big uppercut. All right, she's in some recovery, but it doesn't matter. Yep. She's instant recovery again, and she's about Didn't to tag out. Like you want to get back in the ring? Again? Rip. Seriously? Everything always makes me want to get back in the ring. Justine, right, come here. we talked about this. Don't worry, I know my role. For now. This is a little uh, foreshadowing there, but oh, I got. I tried to dodge, Honestly, but I don't have any stamina. I'm the exception to the rule. Generally, not into bringing indie talent. Oh god, she's too strong! I'm not gonna use instant recovery. Is she trying to pin me? That should be alright. Yeah, I got like no limb damage. I think one of my signatures is a running one, so. Pretend you're at a live show. We're an audience of hundreds. Okay, dude, <laughs> I'm getting destroyed by Starla here. She's got no payback, so if I can actually do something here, that'd be great. Okay, rollout's not bad. 2024 Las Vegas tryouts. Oh, she's a psycho. Big reversal. Get off me. <laughs> Definitely not jealous of the talent in the ring right now. Okay, dude, I'm getting destroyed not here. <laughs> My God. I wonder if there's a different outcome, whether you win or lose, or if it's just going to be a generic... Uh... Oh my, I can't reverse. <laughs> How did I have such a good start against Donovan? I cannot reverse anything. I'm about to use instant recovery just to get back in the game. That reminds hey, me get of something me. I do in the ring. Sure, but she's not actively oh, quick betraying taunt. anyone right now. I bet she has it in her, though. Come here. What is, what is this move? Oh my, that was a reversal? <laughs> Pretty exciting. Okay, I thought I had a running. Oh, I don't even have a signature bar. Never mind. Oh, not this computer. Big reversal. All right. All 
Honestly, I'm just gonna let her tag out. Big reversal. Oh! Yeah, apparently everyone's just super strong here. <laughs> yeah, I got Iron Jaw. I'll have Comeback if I get hurt enough, but... Okay, I'm rolling out. Valley, help. You've done nothing for me here. I'm sure there's DQs in this. <laughs> oh, I tried to wake up Tom, but she wasn't down. That was a big. Oh, never mind. Okay. I remember what she was like in TBD. I didn't think it was. Ah, oh, God, Northern Lights, Fisherman. One, two. Oh, she actually kicked out. Am I scripted to lose or something? <laughs> All right, get up. I thought I was gonna get interrupted, but I guess not. Come Finish your move. Now, we don't oh. bait. Swing bait into a uh, low drop kick here. Very nice. Yeah, I just want to stun her. I might go for sharpshooter here. What? <laughs> I'm going to get pinned off my own move? Oh, I'm not going to be able to stun her now. Give me a second here. I'm injured. Wasn't expecting to see two on one today. Oh, no. No, do not tag out. Oh my god. <laughs> Give me a second. <laughs> no. <laughs> if I could just at least reverse her once here, I've literally done nothing. Of course. Donna and Starla are looking great here. No question who the stars of this match are. Alright, uh, come on now. <laughs> she did one move and then tagged. <laughs> oh god. By the way, oh, I need to reverse this. Hold on. Don't hold back. Nope, it was Give a slow out. kick. I had no idea what to expect. Iron Jaw is not going to help. One. Big kick out. Okay. No. <laughs> I don't know how long each of these parts are going to be, but oh my god, I'm playing terrible right now. We've got a good crop of I can't hit any reversals today, or breakers when Starla's in the ring right. for some reason. I'm beginning to suspect like, obviously, it's my fault, shots. but I'm just saying, like, it's weird how I've missed, like, all... I guess she keeps doing heavy attack. Maybe I should start guessing heavy. Of course, the one... And of course, as soon as I guess heavy, she does light. Was I this pathetic in my WWE tryout? Oh, more so, I should say. What? Ask stupid questions, get stupid answers. Oh my, I, dude, I literally truth. cannot reverse. Tag. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I, I thought my comeback would come up, but it's not letting me switch to it. Jesus. I, this is the worst I've ever played in this game. Oh, I'm stunned. Do I really, I think it's not worth it to use Iron Jaw here. Do they have the same moveset or what? <laughs> I'll just do a possum pin and call it a day here. Finally! Oh my god, let's actually do something now. Signature move. Jumping TKO. I'm just gonna pin so Starla comes in and she's debuffed. Okay. That's it. Desperate times. Sharpshooter. I've had enough and I want Starla one on one after this. Get out! There you go. Shotzi, I hope you saw that. Oh, just nothing. Oh. <laughs> My god, it's the Undertaker. I wonder if there actually was any reason. Is that just filler or is it actually going to be a different cutscene? I won't know. It's my first playthrough, so I have no idea, but. Oh. <laughs> That's how we do it in TVD. Two opponents and you still wipe the floor with them. You're Psycho Sally, right? I saw your tape online. Don't get the psycho part, but we can work on that. And you're new enough that she probably hasn't ruined you by teaching you bad habits yet. Whatever grudge you have against me, don't take it out on Sally. She deserves this opportunity, not your snark. It's okay, Cap. I, I can take it. 
Even if I am also totally overwhelmed that one of my favorite WWE superstars knows who I am. So, did I pass your little challenge? Anyone can get lucky in one match. Luck? Cap's always great in the ring. I watched her almost set a woman on fire. Believe me, I miss some of the stuff I used to do in the indies more than anyone. But in WWE, we don't set people on fire on a whim. <laughs> on a whim? You should have seen the whole story, though. It was an epic culmination, a confrontation for the ages. Let's go, Sally. We're wasting our time talking to her. But, but I'm proud of what we do in TBD. Right, right. TBD is so unique. TBD is so different. So different that apparently it never had room for me. Honestly, still kind of weird your whole thing. I was just to about that. to say that, actually. You're proud of TBD? Then show us this crazy, unique TBD style you're all about. Let's see a no DQ match. Actually, all right, get the gasoline. Where's Kane at? That won't be a problem. Against her. Oh. <laughs> I'll do respect to Psycho. You and I both know that she's not ready to take me on in that kind of match, Shotzi. You, you don't want to fight me, Cap? You know it's not that. Hey, I gotta earn my Psycho stripe sometime, right? Why not at a WWE tryout? At the crossroads of possibly the most important opportunity of my life. Yeah. Why not? You heard her before. She can take it. Are you sure you're okay with this? Let's do it. I know they're not gonna do this, but imagine if they did it where like I accidentally like severely injured her or something or lit her on fire. And by the way, it was kind of hilarious that um Shotzi's like, I don't get the psycho part. Doesn't your theme song literally have the word psycho in it? <laughs> like what what are you talking about? Alright, any stories? DMs here. I don't think I'm gonna be reading all of those, though. So. Right, Justine, how how are you standing for the shots? He's just ruining everything. Couldn't help it over here. Perhaps a bit of bad blood between you and Shotzi. No, you know what? I said I was gonna be the good guy here, but I'm going at her. I guess so. Not what I was expecting coming here today. But if she wants to start trouble. I'm more than happy to finish it. I've heard all about that fighting spirit and attitude you bring to your matches. Isn't that a good thing? I mean, I've heard about your fighting spirit too, Justine. WWE champion and legend comes back only to screw with her niece. Maybe not the best person to have grooming the next generation of WWE talent at NXT. Funny. That's actually what got me my new job. Well, that and my decades worth of experience and unparalleled wisdom. It's weird how, like, obviously, I guess for emergency, sake, like, they, they're talking about storylines as, as if, like, they're real things. It's like, we're, I get it. It's like a game and, like, they wouldn't just, like, pull the curtain back, but still. Such as? <laughs> Don't forget that in this business, you have to play a bit of politics and remember the long game. Sometimes letting bad blood fester can come back to bite you. I'm a bit of an expert on that. Makes sense. Another word of advice? This match that Shotzi made for you against Sally, don't hold back. Taking it easy on someone close to you won't do them any favors. Understood. All right, well, it can't go as bad as that last match. I want that other girl one-on-one, -on -one, though. <laughs> All right, go to match. All right, I'm getting the gasoline ready. <laughs> Psycho Sally is done. Dream. Only Psycho Sid was in this game. Convinced me to let this go forward, shot. It's a tryout. Okay, right? Actual objectives. Ooh. Or not? I wonder. I wish it would tell, tell me like the overalls and stuff. Anyone, Obviously, I think I'm gonna do a stream of like uh, messing around with NPCs. I always like doing that, and then eventually NPC tournaments. But I've never even done that for 22 and 23 yet. Psycho's not doing too poorly for herself either. Are you psycho? Oh my god! If there's actually an objective of setting the table on fire again, I'm gonna laugh. <laughs> if I was writing this story, it would be uh, 
the next objective, you pull out the table, light on fire, but you accidentally burn down the arena. <laughs> and then they don't hire you, and you gotta work your way back up. Oh, combos we got. Duty two! I'm gonna do a crowd taunt for the non existent crowd here. Acting like Danielson right now. Oh, I should have set outside dives. May I might need to change this moveset a few times. I bet this isn't how these women thought today would go. <laughs> well, if I did a crowd taunt but did nothing with it, it's about to expire. Okay, wow, I am playing so bad. <laughs> All right, please. <laughs> How many missed reversals can one man have? All right, well, here's the extreme part here. No, that, hey, that's my gimmick. Come on now, you can't be doing this. All right. All right, come here. I'm not impressed. I'm impressed with this fisherman. Okay, I got reverse them, right? Well, I'll take the momentum from kicking out though. So I need it. She is like max vitality almost. We need to knock that down. Come here. Is that really? Use a weapon. Well, I guess I'm using this table she brought in for convenience sake. Yep. That was. Why was that sound effect so loud? I <laughs> oh, got neck breaker. Okay. Oh my, I can't believe I missed that. Okay, stop. <laughs> oh, wait, I forgot if I said, I think I said at the beginning this, like, my character was 5'7. I think she's actually 5'4, not 5'7. So yeah, this, this is pretty safe. <laughs> you got, Miss TBD. Sally with the signature move, alright. Sally, come here. Wing blade, drop kick combo. Vintage Vicky. Vintage Vicky vibrant. <laughs> Get a finisher. Already check this out. No! Oh my am I, what? <laughs> my controller turned off? Oh my god. I just, what? It says my controller's off, but it's on. What? Dude, I've been having mega problems with Xbox controllers recently. It's really annoying actually. Honestly, oh my god, I have to get another finisher. That's so frustrating, dude. Well, I guess let's not waste this. Come here. Of course you reversed. God, it's so frustrating how that's the same button. I think- I can't remember if I talked about that in the first match or not. Okay, can I just not pick anybody up or do they keep reversing? Even on opposite sides, these two have chemistry. An enemy is just a friend you haven't wronged yet. Dark. I like okay, it. Thank you, Regal. God. Oh, this might actually go to the table. Oh, that would actually would have been cool. <laughs> wow, that is so frustrating. I really wish they would change that where it's a different button. That's been a problem for years, actually. That and the flimsy tables. Literally the opposite problem weak. what I had last time. Glad I never had to wrestle in your dumb promotion TBD after all. If Jesus. I didn't know better, I'd say Shotzi doesn't really feel that way. What? WWE superstars aren't always fully transparent with their feelings and emotions? Yeah. Enough. <laughs> Should have ordered more weapons, I suppose. I wonder if this is, I was gonna say, I wonder if this is false kind of anywhere, but the referee never actually, uh, came out. Okay, trading blows, I need some momentum here. We're Predictions now, will I waste this flaming table? Is someone gonna bump into it and it's gonna fall cap, over? Right? Don't worry, we'll be here for hours today. I'll order a pizza. She's stunned. 
Well, I can, I'll just do the free finisher. Bye. Oh, what? <laughs> My table! <laughs> By God! Is that all you got? Show me more, Miss TBD. I'd be happy to. Get in here. I wonder if my table's gonna come back. All I ever wanted was to take you on. <laughs> Be my guest. We'll see how this ends. Ladies, ladies. This is unbecoming of a WWE tryout. I don't know. I thought it was pretty cool. Would be cooler to lay her out right now. Try it. No, there'll be none of that. At least not without an audience. Yeah, this is that business smart don't coming in. Count? Shotzi, you're in need of a tune-up match before your title opportunity against Bianca Belair. And our guest today is the perfect local talent we're looking for to face you. She'll push you. A real challenge. She certainly fits the bill to be my punching bag. If you're amenable, I'd like to book you on the next Raw. Ooh. As a local talent? You are local, right? Yeah, I'm no tune-up match, though. But for a chance to settle this with Shotzi, I'm in. Fantastic. Then it's settled. Hey, Miss Psycho. I'm impressed with your... What's the word? <laughs> Moxie? That's it. I'm signing you to NXT. <laughs> oh, let's go. You won't regret it. <laughs> Rip. <laughs> Meanwhile, the arena's on, on fire in the background because the table never got used. Fire department is on the way. All right, welcome to Raw. I can't believe you got into a fight and that's how you get to debut on Raw. Very funny. I'm not debuting on Raw. I'm just having a match. They asked me here to wrestle and that I can do. Tell that to the millions of people who will be watching you wrestle on Raw for the first time from their homes tonight. Even if this opportunity doesn't mean the same to you, don't waste it. Why do you think I brought tinfoil to take home the food from catering? <sighs> I'm serious. So am I. Listen, I hear you, but I also know why I'm here. Local talent almost never win these matches, but I do intend to make an impression. I brought the hey, gasoline. Watch where you're going. Excuse my oblivious friend. Wait a minute. TBD? Yeah? I've heard of that. Welcome to Raw. <laughs> All right. <laughs> See? Making an impression already. Oh, whatever. Good luck out there tonight. I'm going in the business for myself. I got the gasoline. I'm ready to go. <laughs> And we got Shotzi calling me on social media. Let's go to the. I mean, I feel like this uh, this stories tab is all that's gonna be important to me. Okay, Regal. You made it. Welcome to Raw. I'm happy to be Thank here. Thank you. I'm happy to be here and grateful for the opportunity. And we're happy to have you. Now that you've hopefully had time to get settled. The show's not too far off from starting. I suggest getting changed into your gear. I'm ready. You are wearing a t-shirt? <laughs> not just any t-shirt. This very TBD t-shirt. Why? Because <laughs> my my promoter told me to do it. I'm proud to rep I'm TBD. I'm proud to rep TBD. If I'm going to have this opportunity, I want to also support something I believe in and share it with a larger audience. I get it, and I respect your passion. Tell you what, just don't tell anyone else we've talked about this. I know there are some who would want me to make you change. I'm surprised they're allowing change? us. Change? Me? <laughs> you don't know me that well. Right then. Good luck out there. All right, time to debut on Raw. Let's do it. Stone Cold! Stone Cold!
and Shotzi's opponent, who comes to WWE with a reputation. Yeah, so I got all these generic Tron various colors. I'm using the preset uh, Britt Baker face entrance. It's just called like the doctor is in or something. I see she's repping a local promotion. Does her shirt say TBD? I know her. She's the captain. A bit of a legend on the indie circuit. I think she could give Shotzi some trouble tonight. I'm kind of curious how they're going to present this because like she said, local talent are just here to enhance somebody else so like is it gonna be scripted where i just lose or <laughs> it'd be kind of funny if i actually do go in the business for myself what it takes to make it in wwe hey listen i'm only booked for one match here all right i planted the gasoline under the ring before the match we're ready to go I'm hoping they'd say something about like unique commentary, but no. I guess I'll watch it. Just like that tank, Shotzi herself is a loose cannon, and that's putting it lightly. You never know what kind of thing Shotzi is gonna do to her opponents or even herself. You're absolutely right, Saxton. I mean, Shotzi shaved her head just to intimidate an opponent. Always wanting to throw caution to the wind and do anything to win. You know what's funny? I'm trying to remember what my other finishers are. So I got Sharpshooter, uh, Northern Lights Fisherman, and I put some other ones too. I don't remember. I think it's Shining Wizard, maybe? I mean, I could just pause and check. Alright, so just to recap here. So, got a problem with Shotzi, because apparently she didn't get booked on uh, TBD. And apparently she has an upcoming championship match against Bianca Belair, who's the Women's World Champion, I guess. Not afraid to fight, knows how to survive. And she's pretty fun to watch inside the ring, too. Honestly, I'm kind of hoping there's more matches that have, like, cutscene endings so we can see more unique stuff instead of just playing matches. I feel like that's gonna happen as we get further in, but we're kind of starting out here. Let's see, I hopefully my controller stops messing up, too. Underway, Shotzi's opponent is looking pretty confident for her first time on Raw. Even though she hasn't been in WWE wow, before, I'm actually going over, apparently. I gotta defeat Shotzi. All around the world. I think this stage is going to phase her one bit. Yeah. I don't know. Are you psycho? She's done before this, but nothing can compare to the what? Where are you going? <laughs> At some point in this match, it will play a it's for TBD. Back, yeah. Drop, driven down. Boom. Need my generic gear ready to go. Rolling elbow finds its mark. Ouch. Shotzi holds her off. Right, come here. This is all a shoot, by the way. It's supposed to be much differently. I'm exposing her on live TV. <laughs> <laughs> is what you get. Oh. What? What is she trying to do? What is? And how is she already orange in the head? What is happening right now? That offense taking a toll on her. All right, combo by God. Capture suplex. Love that move. Just a continuous rush on Shotzi here. Yeah, Shotzi finding herself on the wrong end of every. She finally, is she gonna walk away again or actually do something? A big brawn breaker right there. On top of reversal. Number there. Okay, I got like, no stamina here, so light attack, knock her down. No, no. Belly to belly. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Boat down. Oh, I think I remember my other finish now. I think it's a running famous, sir. Oh, I missed that. Impressive pulp. Oh, no! There goes all that momentum. That sucks so much. Not even I think Trading Blows minigame might save you here. She sent flying into the corner. Wicked I think I'm gonna do a crowd taunt and then do the minigame. She's feeling it, and the WWE universe is feeling it too. Get some good momentum here. No size of either. By the way, I watched the IGN review from this game and they talked about this mini game, but they said like all wrong information. They claim there's no way to initiate it, which is not true, and that it has no effect on gameplay or advantage for the winner. That is also not true because you can stun your opponent and get a ton of momentum from doing this. And it can only be done once per match, so it's balanced too. So like, 
When I saw that in the review, I'm like, what are you talking about? This is all not true. <laughs> one for gold. Let's go! Okay, actually, let's just go to our moves thing real quick. So, yeah, um... Hurricane Rana, Sling Bay Drop, the X Factor, Rope Rebound. So I got Fisherman, Northern Lights, Suplex, Sharpshooter, Famous or Running, Sliced Bread in the Corner. That's my other one. Shotzi at a disadvantage. Okay, I had no stamina, so I guess we're doing the Fisherman. My oh, God! This is for TBD and Psycho Sally. And, and she kicked out. Yeah, okay, I have come back, but we don't really need it. Oh! <laughs> at least not yet, I should say. Performance. Ooh, Instant recovery, first. we don't need it. We're fine. I need the momentum. Everything's fine. Foot meet back. I mean, if my signature gets reversed, I'm absolutely using instant or um come back. Right I'm gonna hit her with the wake up taunt. I need stamina, so there is no way this can go on for much longer. Maybe I should have stun her and then go for finisher. She dodged that one nicely. Okay. Breaker here. Pull back deck. Oh, she's stunned. Get up. Okay, I can actually do my running finisher this time. Famous, sir! Cover for TBD. Buy the t-shirt now. It's only Shotzi is just as bewildered as us. I think furious is the word you're looking for. That was a shoot. Oh no! Taking out her frustration. To the outside, coming our way. A loss like this could put Shotzi's title opportunity against Bianca Belair at risk. Yes, he lost clean on Raw. But there's a reversal. Oh God. Shotzi up for something big here. We got to move. Look at Corey Graves. My oh, God. The table. Talk about a raw debut. Would have preferred a what flaming the... table. Oh. <laughs> Sorry about the table, boys. But Shotzi asked for more from Miss TBD. So she got it. Thanks for the mic, Byron. And by the way, watch our show. I have the t-shirt too. Plug the t-shirt. Well, that sure was <laughs> something. For God's sake, hold on to your mic next time, Saxton. Wow, Byron, that's the most action you've seen in years. They're just joking over a dead shot. <laughs> Rip. I think I might do one more match and then call it here for this part. Someone's gonna be furious backstage. <laughs> We gotta go. Can't imagine the suits are gonna be too happy. Yeah, for real. Let's let this suit speak for himself. Oh, I'm done. It's over. Shall we? Damn. Of all the impulsive, unhinged disasters I've witnessed in my career, my dear, that had to be one of the most excellent. Wait. What? You went out and defeated Shotzi. And then, when things went sideways, you kept your head, stood up for yourself, and made a memorable moment for everyone in the WWE Universe. Well done. So you'll still pay me then? You're not only getting paid. I'd like to offer you a full-time WWE Damn. Raw contract. With all due respect, I'm not sure if I'm the type of person you want working for you. You have a lot of assumptions about who we are and what we want. And, with all due respect, I'd suggest letting us decide those things for ourselves. I heard how people responded, and I'm telling you, WWE wants you. I truly appreciate the offer, sir, but I... Can we have a moment? I don't really think we need to... Just give us a second. Why not? I'm just in the middle of a live show and trying to offer you a life-changing opportunity. But please, take your time. Lim Jim's in the background, by the way. 
Dude, it was so cool. Just give us a moment, but let me check my phone first. Alright, what do you gotta say? Can I get that Slim Jim gift basket? Looks pretty good. I know that wasn't you about to tell William Regal no to a WWE contract. Wait, is this you telling me to say yes to William Regal in a WWE contract? Why wouldn't you sign? Oh, I got a choice. I don't want WWE to change me. They're going to ruin me. They're going to kill my character. They're going to take away my gasoline. It's over. I don't want to abandon you in TBD. I guess I don't have a reason. <laughs> what a terrible answer. Uh, I mean, I'm repping TBD. I said to watch the show, so I guess this makes the most sense, right? Everything we've built together with TBD, our mission... You know how much it means to me. I don't want to abandon TBD. And I don't want to abandon you. TBD isn't going anywhere. You think I'm going to let our momentum stop just because you get to go to the bigs? No way. Give it a chance. You hate it here, you come back home. But don't say no to the adventure. I mean, it is kind of cool that Regal recognizes what I bring to the table. And that was only one match. You did that with what everyone assumed would be a quick victory for Shotzi. And you don't think this is selling out? Remember when we decided to start TBD? Of course I do. As much as I wish I could forget that show, that promoter had such a narrow vision of what wrestling should be. And we sat down at that diner and decided if we ever started a promotion, we would let all kinds of people with all types of ideas get in the ring and fight, literally, for their vision. Yeah, we were very idealistic before we had to pay bills. <laughs> Remember those contracts we signed with each other on those diner napkins? <laughs> but we did follow through on all of those plans. Aside from coming up with a name besides TBD, of course. My point is, we had a mission. Still do. And now, you're getting a very real chance to take your vision to a company that has more reach than anyone else. Do you really want to make a difference and change this industry into what you think it could be? You can't say no. Damn. I guess I have to find Regal and tell them yes then. I'll let you get to it. Just don't big time us when you come home to visit, okay? <laughs> no promises. There you go. At least our promoter's honorable, man. Not holding us back. Doing the right thing. Sign with WWE. The press of a button. Taking the title with there me, too. She is the so called captain who came out of nowhere to defeat Shotzi and earn a raw contract. Came out of nowhere for you, maybe, but anyone who's been paying attention to the independent wrestling scene knows this woman has been a champion and a cornerstone of the promotion known as TBD for quite some time. WWE and Raw are lucky to have her. Or oh, did they change the C4 energy drink machine? Ooh, first achievement. All right, sign on the dotted line. Sign to WWE Raw. All right, social media saying. <laughs> DMs, you sold out. How dare you betray TVD? I can't believe it. Hello, hello. Welcome to Raw. Big fan, big fan. Really? Oh, everyone on the team is a long-time admirer. Ever since we got word last week. It's a quick pivot to squeeze you in, but we're used to things changing fast around here. Not a problem at all. Didn't think it would be? I'm Troy Simkin. Yep, I'm that guy. I'm sure you've heard the more established superstars mention their favorite WWE producer. I don't think I have. <laughs> hmm. Are you not mingling with your peers? That's kind of a must-do around here. Actually, we have several handy documents outlining all the unwritten do's and don'ts. Doesn't that make them written? But before we get sidetracked, what I was getting at is we already have a few ideas of how to use them. There we go. But we'll be in touch. It's over. Do you maybe want to talk about some of the things I've been thinking or am interested in doing? Like I said, get settled. We're working on some ideas. Gotta run. Later, Cat. They actually call me Cap. Huh. Could have sworn it was Cat. Oh, well. We'll see where we land with the name. All right, I'm about to be repackaged. My career's over. <laughs> uh, that's probably nothing. I mean, 
How many points do I have? Zero. <laughs> Okay, well, I guess we'll just proceed. I guess I, it's just been cutscenes, but I was thinking one more match for this part. Ooh, welcome to Raw. <laughs> just me with my fake picture on here. Oh, wait, story complete. I guess maybe I should end it here then. Oh, you get a My Faction card too? Odyssey Rift, wow. TBD Arena unlocked, a TBD t-shirt, both men and women's, and the TBD championship belt all unlocked. That's pretty cool. Alright, there we go. I guess we'll just end it here then. So that was the first story working our way from TBD to a tryout to our match on Raw. So I guess when we come back in the next part, we're going to actually start on Raw to see. Are they going to ruin my character? Can I still set tables on fire? What shots you have to say? I don't know. We're going to find out in the next part. So I'll see you there.